I've always been very interested in sort of how we can live on this planet and not consume it to death. So in my early days at Microsoft, I tried to address the issue of waste actually through driving better vegetarian options on campus. And since becoming an environmental technologist here, it's actually enabled me to broaden my perspective on all the ways in which we can actually reduce the amount of waste that we generate through the use of IT. The rapid growth in demand for IT is really going to require that IT organizations rethink how they build IT systems. We're buying all this equipment that ends up in data centers that's underutilized for most of its life and then we throw it away after a few years. So essentially we're just digging deeper and deeper holes to build bigger and bigger mountains of e-waste. You know, decades old practices of just overbuilding are not really going to be sustainable either from a financial perspective or if a company wants to ultimately be agile and competitive in terms of bringing new IT services to market as fast as possible. There are two things that IT departments need to do to focus on driving up utilization. The first is governance, ensuring the right incentives and motivations are in place in order to utilize those assets fully. And the second is applications. And developers really need to work with IT departments to create applications that don't assume unlimited IT resources, that can scale dynamically with demand and respond to constraints if and when the IT department needs to impose them. The benefits of driving up utilization are that you're going to save money on hardware and energy, you're going to be more responsive to demands for IT in the future, and you're going to ultimately have an organization that's far more productive and competitive than it used to be.